Hello, friends of Golf Course Quality Fertilizer. Uh, so here we go, another problem. This is an interesting one. Kind of a creepy, creepy uh, uh, one, actually. So, you know, I had a customer, and he's got some arbovitas here, some emerald green, one of my favorite arbovitas. Those are nice trees. And he sent me a picture from a distance, and... I said, oh yeah, they're typically, they can dry out and stuff and have issues with hot, dry summers, especially being at the edge of the property with a slope. And then he took a little closer look and he seen something uh, going on and figured out that it was not dryness. It was bagworms. And so these dudes are creepy. They look like that they're cones right so here let's look over here there's some more that kind of look better like look like a cone right so this guy right here this is actually an insect right here so it looks like a cone right uh and they actually eat here we go we got one right here getting his groove on look how creepy these things are they stay inside their bag oh look he instantly as i messed with him sucked into his bag and tied up but they're actually worms bag worms and they feed on all kinds of little bushes and stuff uh, and so that's what he's got going on they're literally eating his arbovita down to nothing let's see if we can see oh yeah look at that creepy guy he's got his own little house that he takes with him Let's see what happens when we mess with them a little bit. Look at that bagworm eating it up. So he needs to apply an insecticide. What's interesting about bagworms is you have to actually... <laughs> they are creepy. They're crawling all over the place on this thing. I mean, they virtually have defoliated this, ar this arbovita. Isn't that gross? So the thing about bagworms is since they have their own little home that they like to live in, uh, they're a little tougher to kill. You have to wait till they're doing what they're doing right now. Uh, and that is moving around and feeding. Uh, that's when you spray. Uh, you also probably want to use a systemic uh, insecticide that kind of gets inside the plant, which it does. Um, and that's how you kill them. And it might take a couple applications uh you know one and then about a month later hit it again but they have to be out here feeding actively and moving around uh in the thing yeah i just got scared of a thing so that's okay yep bag worms super gross but strange and interesting man they're weird all right there you go bag worms on your trees so if you see what you thought were cones they're not. They're bagworms. See how those look right there? They're not cones. They're bagworms. And bagworms can, people think sometimes that those, like, uh, ones that are in the tree that have the, that looks like webbing and all that stuff, they think those are bagworms. But those are called tent worms uh, that are in, like, crab apple trees and stuff like that. He's only got one on this guy. But you can see how bad and how quickly... They can just literally destroy a tree. So hopefully that one will come back, but I doubt it. Uh, he's probably lost that one already. So he needs to probably treat all of these just to be safe. Thanks for listening.